Hey guys, how are you guys doing today? I wanted to do a quick um, Walmart uh, grocery delivery shopping haul for you guys. What I got for $190 minus the shipping, which was $9, and they reimbursed me another $10 because it was a mistake. So right here, what they gave me as a little present. Um, please excuse my face right now. I'm five months pregnant. I'm exhausted, and I have a toddler who is really sick. So yeah, let's begin. They gave me this little bag that came in as a gift, grocery delivery. It's Walmart grocery delivery thing. And in it, we had a little toy for Emma uh, to play with, which is kind of cool. I didn't even expect that. A little like Linux and stuff, a bunch of coupons for dogs and baby stuff. And then, um, gentle wet wipes and stuff like that and then um, ultimate clean from Cottonelle. I don't know we'll try it I got a lot of stuff for Emma um, some of her favorite snacks this is Bomba it's an Israeli snack they only sell it in Israeli markets Walmart sells it in a kosher part of the thing where international aisle where the kosher stuff is it's right there at the bottom you'll find it and what it is it's basically um, like corn puffs with a little bit of peanut butter in it so um, I've been introducing her peanut butter since she was six months and that's how I've been doing it and she loves them they're great and then obviously her favorite favorite snacks are um, the organic and non-organic basically uh, vegetable pouches and there she is right baby girl you not feeling well yeah she's not feeling well right baby girl Anyhow, so, and then I got her, as I got these little snacks, as I was saying, and those pouches. I got about 16 of those. And they are really affordable, okay? I do like other stuff, but this is good. It's organic, you know? And it's good variety, and she loves them. She eats them as a snack in between meals. Uh, these, or when we go out. This is a new Johnson Johnson moisturizing wash that I got for her with chamomile and lavender. I wanna try that out. I got her this little plate with suction on it because she throws all her food and throws the plate upside down. And then it's perfect because it's in blue and green. And then when we have our little baby boy, he could use it. Uh, baby, C baby swabs. I did get her organic fluoride free toothpaste for kids because she has eight teeth now I did get myself herbal essences uh, hydrating shampoo and conditioning I have I did get myself a herbal essences shampoo and conditioning combo for $3.99 I believe what I do like about it that it smells good and with my shampoo that I have right now which is really good it's Moroccan oil but it's too much it's too oily and I wash my hair every other day being pregnant my skin and my hair is really oily anyways look that's another video <laughs> anyways uh, I got two of these guys two different sizes they're nice this was a dollar fifty and this was two fifty something now that's non perishable items now I got myself corn chips and tortilla because that's what I've been craving for a snack I don't eat a lot of bread but a little bit of this helps me you know with my salty cravings that I like. I got the tikka masala curry. It's non-spicy. I make a lot of chicken and um, vegetables and stuff like that with rice and we love that in a house. I usually use half of it. So I use this for four basically four, four times. It's really good. And then I got the chunky tech salsa. Uh, Walmart brand. It was like a dollar something. It's amazing. The amount of groceries that I got from Walmart. Of course, organic milk for Emma. She only drinks organic. Sometimes I'll give her non-organic, and then I don't know why, but her belly will hurt, and she'll have she'll help her belly will hurt. But they're the cheapest and they're the best, by the way, next to Target. But <clears throat> the delivery service, I don't need to carry it. Literally, Ryan works seven days a week, and uh, it's been really difficult. <laughs> He's barely home. I got whole pickles because that's what I've been craving. Mayo potatoes right here um, cauliflower 
I don't know why they gave me three bunches of organic um, bananas, but that's fine. They'll ripe and I'll clean them, peel them, and put them in the freezer and make them smoothies with it. Cabbage. I usually make delicious cabbage, potatoes, and meat or chicken, beef or chicken, or even without anything, uh, with tomatoes stew, it's delicious to die for. Ryan hates cabbage, but when I make it, he likes it. I got celery, I like to munch on it, and Ryan does too, it's a good snack. I got two bags of fresh spinach, that's for our smoothies and stuff like that. Tomatoes, I've been craving tomatoes, and Emma loves tomatoes. I, I have cucumbers in the fridge that I bought last week. Um, carrots, shredded carrots for pilaf. It's a Russian dish. You could make it with chicken. Traditional, it's made with lamb. Lots of onions, garlic, lots of carrots, and rice. Sweet potatoes. This is a lot of sweet potatoes, and this bag was $3. You know if you go to a regular grocery store, you're going to get one sweet potato for a 99 cents a pound. This was really good price. And then my favorite, my mom, I love the way my mom makes these guys. I don't know what they call them, this little mini pumpkin pumpkins. I don't know what they're called. But my mom would make them in half, clean them, put a little bit of organic brown sugar in them, and a little bit of um, dry fruits like uh, apricots or raisins and stuff, and bake it. Oh my God, it's delicious. I got lentils. as. I did not mention, but we're trying to eat less meat, um, like chicken or beef or lamb. We're trying to minimize, so we're not vegan or vegetarian, but we're trying to cut it down a little bit. I got lentil and barley split pea soup, which is amazing. I'm gonna love these. I usually make it from scratch. I hadn't tried this, but I usually make my own lentil soup with carrots and onions and just vegetable. Emma loves it and Ryan loves it. Actually, we had it last night. So I got this bag was a dollar thirty-nine each one of them, which is amazing. You can't you can go wrong. It's pretty good. I think it's over a pound here. No, yeah, it's a pound. That's a lot. It's gonna last me a while. I got sauerkraut for a salad that I want to make. Hot dogs. I got hot dogs because um, I'm gonna make a salad that I wanna make. And Ryan likes to have a hot dog sometimes when he gets from work. Butter, you can't go wrong with that. Eggs. And then I got lentil soup. I've been craving lentils, I'm not even joking. Um, I got four of these guys. And when I'm hungry for lunch, I could just eat that for myself. Tomatoes, uh, diced peas and uh, carrots, um, New England clean chowder soup. I've been craving that too, but not a lot. And Ryan likes it too. And uh, cream of mushroom soup. I make casserole, chicken and rice and broccoli. Maybe I'll make that because I have broccoli in the fridge. I got two, two of these guys of uh, hummus. It's very healthy and it's good protein sour cream and the most important you guys I got frozen fruit like this is mango and strawberries blueberries berries I've been uh, making uh, smoothies and then we went to a smoothie bar that opened up not far away from us and Emma loved it she loved the smoothie oh my god she loved it I actually took it away to they a little bit of water and she went crazy crying on me but she loved it strawberries and I've been craving with this pregnancy with this little boy I've been craving okra I had fresh okra all last week frozen okra and I make it with sauteed tomatoes and stuff hopefully I'll be able to make um, a video for you guys clean and cook with me where I'll make it and even Ryan hates okra but he likes it and I made a the other night I believe I made sauteed okra with tomatoes and stuff like that I actually found the recipe on YouTube this lady was awesome very easy um, and I made a sloppy joe with uh, beefless ground beef which was vegan ground beef basically and Ryan couldn't tell the difference and he loved it 
and I made that and I made it as a sandwich. Oh my God, he went crazy for it. Anyways, I got green beans, lots and lots, three packets of um, sweet peppers and onions. I make an omelet in the morning, vegan hamburger, burgers, vegan bird patties, vegan hot dogs for me, and chicken strips. These chicken strips that are vegan, I don't know if any of you guys ever went to Whole Foods um, and tried the vegan chicken salad. You gotta try it. It is to die for. It is amazing. It's vegan chicken salad. And I found the recipe that it's exact or copycat of that um, recipe that they have at Whole Foods. And I made it and Ryan loves it for work and I love it to eat it. You know, I love to eat it. Anyways, there's bread, buns. This is all of it, you guys. This is crazy. That's a lot of food for $189. So $190 plus taxes. And taxes were like $1.39. They did charge me a delivery fee for $9, but they are going to reimburse me that. And they gave me additional $10 off for next order. Anyhow, that's what it is. This is something that we got from BJ's. It's like Costco. Or Sam's Club. We got this two weeks ago. Uh, when I'm extremely thirsty, I'll drink that. But that's pretty much it, you guys. Uh, that's not a bad shopping haul, I think, for that amount of money. With fresh fruits and vegetables. And frozen vegetables. And a lot of vegan stuff. So if you're a vegan and you're looking for something to deliver. Because you can't drive and you only think Whole Foods has it. No. Believe it or not. Online delivery with Walmart they do have it. I'm extremely happy. I'm gonna go ahead and close this little shopping haul with you guys and my phone is ringing. My mom's calling me. Um, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe. Comment down below. If you have a shop with Walmart online, grocery delivery thing. And if you watched all the way till the end, please thumbs up the video haul. And let me know how it is, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> Bye.